So welcome to this session on the newton raphson method. We will learn how to derive the newton raphsons iterative formula here. So use newton raphsons method to derive an iterative formula for square root of n. So let x equal to square root of n. So x squared equal to n. fx equal to x squared minus n. So what will be f dash x? It will be 2x. So using newton raphsons formula, xn plus 1 equal to xn minus f of xn by f dash xn. So that will be xn minus f of xn will be xn squared minus n by f dash xn will be 2xn. So taking the LCM, this becomes 2xn squared minus xn squared plus n by 2xn, which is xn squared plus n by 2xn. So this is your iterative formula. Now to find, hence find square root of 12. We have this iterative formula x1 equal to x0 squared plus 12 by 2x0. Now square root of 9 is 3, square root of 16 is 4. So we choose x0 as 3. So this becomes 9 plus 12 by 6 which is 3.5. Now x2 equal to x1 squared plus 12 by 2x1. That will be 3.5 squared plus 12 by 7 which is 3.4643. And x3 equal to x2 squared plus 12 by 2x2. That will be 3.4643 squared plus 12 by 2 into 3.4643, which is 3.4641. Again, continuing, taking x4 equal to x3 squared plus 12 by 2x3. This becomes 3.4641 squared plus 12 by 2 into 3.4641. That is 3.4641. So your answer will be 3.4641 which is square root of 12. Coming to the next question. Use Newton, derive Newton Raphson's iterative formula to find the real root of x log x to the base 10 equal to 1.2. Again we have the formula xn plus 1 equal to xn minus f of xn by f dash xn fx equal to log x to the base 10 minus 1.2. So f dash x will be x d dx of log x to the base 10 plus log x to the base 10. That is x d dx of log x to the base e into log e to the base 10 plus log x to the base 10. Derivative of log x to the base e is 1 by x, x into 1 by x log e to the base 10 plus log x to the base 10. That will be 0.4343 plus log x to the base 10. So now log e to the base 10 is 0 0.4343. So xn plus 1 becomes xn minus, we have this formula instead of f of xn, I will write xn log xn to the base 10, 10 minus 1.2 by 0 0.4343 plus log xn to the base 10. So that will be xn into 0 0.4343 plus log xn to the base 10 minus xn log xn to the base 10 plus 1.2 by 0 0.4343 plus log xn to the base 10. So simplifying you get it as 0 0.4343 xn plus 1.2 by 0 0.4343 plus log xn to the base 10. Hence, find an approximate root of the equation x log x to the base 10 equal to 1.2. So let fx equal to x log x to the base 10 minus 1.2. Now f of 1 is minus 1.2 which is less than 0. f of 2 is minus 0 0.6 which is less than 0. f of 3 is 0 0.23 which is greater than 0. So we take x0 as 3. And x1 will be equal to use the formula x0 minus f of x0 by f dash x0. So this becomes 0.4343. This is the iterative formula. 0.4343 into 3 plus 1.2 by 0.4343 plus log 3 to the base 10. This is 2.7462. And x3 becomes 0 0.4343 into x1. That is 2.7462 plus 1.2 by 0.4343 plus log x1 to the base 10 that is 2.7407 again x3 is 0 0.4343 x2 plus 1.2 by 0 0.4343 plus log x2 to the base 10 
So when you substitute, you get it as 2.7407. So your approximate root is 2.7407. So we have learned how to derive the iterative formula for Newton-Raphson method and how to apply it in problems. Thank you.